What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dangling with Dev YouTube video. Today we're going to be doing just some straight up fishing for you guys. We're actually at a uh, local little golf course that uh, one of my boys, Pond Boys, if y'all have not heard of Pond Boys, go check him out on uh, YouTube and Instagram. He's massive on Instagram. Blow his YouTube up. I'll leave him link down in the description below, but this guy's an absolute hammer. He sent me some pictures of some fish that he caught here and just told me that it was absolutely on fire. So what we're going to be doing is going out with just a popper and a swim bait and seeing the biggest bass we can get on. If y'all been on the channel at all over the last year, you know that every now and then I'll go out and search for a 10 pound bass. It's been about a year and a half since I caught anything over 10. Um, my actual PB on scale is only like 8, 4, but I promise you I've caught many over 10. One of the pictures he sent me from this spot this fish, this fish was like 11 pounds. Like, no joke, 11 pounds. Go check him out. Link down in the description. Without further ado, let's just get to fishing. All right, guys, we're starting off with a popper. As you can see, it's extreme. Well, y'all can't really see. It's really overcast. Speaking of seeing, sorry for the line and the uh, camera lens. I have uh, dropped it and broke it. But like I said, we're starting out with the popper. See if we can get on a uh, little good morning bite since it's so cold. Well, 72 degrees, but just got through raining. See, we know just a big old bassy bass top water, and then I got that swim bait. I wish I had a rattle trap for you guys, a little lipless crank. Also, guys, I want to say happy Thanksgiving. I took some time off from uh, from filming just to spend time with family, but we're gonna get back on the grind for y'all because, uh, yeah, we got to. Hello, big dog. <laughs> no, I just got here. Oh, for real? You flying back to Texas? Huh? You flying back to Texas? Yeah. For real? Nice. How big was that one you caught yesterday? I'd say high nine, bro. For real? Yeah, had it high nine. Just on a lipless? Uh, yeah, I'm a lipless. Where, uh... Where you had luck out here? Where? Yeah. Uh, I'm just, this is pretty much all I fish. It's just this little area and then those little points. Okay. I mean, it's hit or miss, honestly. Most of my bites aren't consistent. It's like whenever. Four strikes. You can tell there's like a good amount of pressure. Yeah. It's never like up to here, you I'd never even heard about fishing this place. I actually got until I was fishing that neighborhood I told you about and uh had a sheriff pull up and he's like hey bro you gotta go and i was like all right he's like you can go fish and i was like for real and he showed me like pictures that he caught out here i was like oh damn there's some big fish boy i just got into <laughs> i just i just straight drove into one of the most private places you can be. <laughs> Bro, that gate guard is the G. Let's go. All right, guys and gals, I'm in a little uh, spot that I probably shouldn't be, but we're still gonna be giving it the old dangle. Oh, no way. What was that? Oh my gosh, what was that? Oh, there's a gator right here. Didn't even see him. Be careful, Florida. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What is this? What is this? What is this? Something huge is right here. I don't know if it's a carp or what. He might be good. Oh, he's good, he's good, he's good, he's good, he's good. He's good, he's good, he's good. Come on, come on. Oh yes, he's good. Stay down. Oh my gosh, he's giant. He's giant, he's giant, he's giant, he's giant. Come on, come on, come on. Stay pinned, stay pinned. God, this is a huge fish. This is a huge fish. This is a huge fish. Oh my gosh, another one. Let's go, dude. Let's freaking go. Gosh, 
she fought so much harder. Oh man. Oh, ho, ho, ho. nice little four pounder right on, maybe three, eight, four pounds. Let's go, dude. We've been after him all freaking day. This fish is so cold. I'll give him three and a half now. I'm looking at him. He was fighting and his mouth came flash. I thought he was giant, guys. Let's go. There was two of them actually right there. I don't know if y'all saw, I'll play it. I'll try to play it back, but when he was running, there was another one. Let's see if we can get him. Oh, bad, bad cast. Yeah, he was, there was two of them chasing this thing. I thought I had seen one swirl right here. I didn't know if it was a carp or not. Oh man, oh man, let's go. Come on, Devin, come on, Devin. Anytime on a, a golf course like this, especially in this area of Florida, there's no, got him, come on. Another little four pounder, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, they were in a school right there. Let's go, flip them up. Bank flip, bank flip, bank flip. Oh. Oh, yeah. Dude, another solid fish. That's what I really want. Another three and a half for right there. Let's do a, uh, let's eyeball. Well, I have my scale. If I catch one over five, I'll weigh it. But I think we can all agree this is three and a half. It's pretty long fish. He's literally longer than my arm. So yeah, three and a half. So we'll call it two, three and a half just to be safe. Put us at seven pounds total for our, our top five right now. Oh man. I wonder if they're all pushed up in here right now swim bait coming in clutch baby swimming is slow too like very very slow before we do that let me take a couple more casts right here in this little cove maybe there's a big one just hanging out i'm just not too sure Freaking missed them. Freaking way, bro. There's no way that just happened. How you doing? Good. Kicking me out? Yeah, you can't fish. Yeah. Come on the side. Okay. It's fine. You just keep it on top. Of okay, yeah, I was at that small one earlier and there was yeah. no one golf, so I just cut across. I got you. I'll head on back. I gotta go. Yeah, well, I lost two in here, and that small one I caught two four pounders. So yeah. I'm gonna walk back that way. Is that okay? Yeah, 
Yeah, but anywhere, okay. Wed, you're going to have a group coming up here. Yeah, I saw them. Second, but yeah, any homeowner's side, okay. you're fine. They just don't allow them to go for it. All right, thank you. Uh, I just caught two bass right over there. Really? Yeah, so. That's awesome. Yeah, I got a YouTube channel, so I just go around fish and cool. post on YouTube. Yes, sir. Where do you catch? Just bass. Um, I mean, unless every now and then I'll catch like catfish randomly or redfish, but. What's your bait? Uh, today I'm just using a swim bait. It's a uh, just a little bait fish imitation. Wow. So yeah, I was fish. Like uh, yeah, the I, the two four pounders I caught over there were about the length of my forearm to my fingers. Um, but I've heard of like 10 pounders in here, so here? yes, in the, just in this neighborhood, so really? yes, sir. Uh, so do you want some to drink? Uh, no, I'm okay, I appreciate it though. Sure? Yeah, 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 I'm, I'm, no, no, I catch and release only. Oh, you got your own YouTube channel, yes, sir. So, what I do for work, really? Yes, sir. What, what, what's your YouTube channel? It's called Dangling with Dev, Dangling with Dev. yes, sir. Oh, that's cool, man. Uh, well, welcome, yes, sir. Thank you. I hope I didn't. Walking. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Oh, I gladly. Really? <laughs> yes, sir. I'll I'll teach you. So, have you ever used JD Weld for fishing? Or just in general? Oh, I mean, I have. I, I'll give you some free samples next time. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I'm part owner. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, nice. I'm the sales guy for them too, though. Really? Yeah. We did a. Uh, so I have some friends uh, who have like really, really big fishing YouTube channels and we bought, we actually used JB Weld in one of them. We, uh, he bought, his name is Fishing with Norm. He bought this like $3,000 electric reel for Marlin. Yeah. And when we got it, it was broken. The gear, the gear was broken yeah. and I'm the only mechanically inclined one in the friend group. So I was like, all right, well, we can't weld this back together. I was like, we can JB weld it and see if that works. And it did. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. I'll get a picture of us and then I'll send it to you. Oh, okay. <laughs> He pulled drag. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, tighten that drag down. Oh, he's not that big. He just pulled drag. <laughs> All right. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, dude, look how healthy this little dude is. Oh, look at that. Y'all are y'all are feeding up like crazy. There you go. Nice little. Uh, I'll give him right at two pounds because he's so so tummied up. He pulled drag like crazy. I'm glad you weren't a giant because I would have lost you. Let's go. All right, so we're sitting at uh, roughly nine pounds with our top three. He pulled the hell out of my drag. Oh, there's a fish. Stop that. 100% there's a fish. Big him, big fish. Oh, big fish. Oh, come on. Stay pinned. Oh, he took off. Stay tight, stay tight. Oh, he took off. Stay down, stay down, stay down. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here, big fish, big fish, big fish. Let's go, come on. Tire him out. Stay down. Flip him. 
Oh my god, he's pulling. No, stay down, stay down. One more time. Jeez. Good lord. Good lord. He's pulling. Come on. Big flip. Let's freaking go. Right at six pounds. Let's get that scale. Probably right under six. Oh man. There we go, guys. We got a five eight something. I can't see because my glasses. Oh my gosh. Almost a six pounder. Turn off, dude. Oh yeah, beautiful, beautiful fish. Super healthy, super thick. Let's go, dude. Oh my gosh, this fish is gorgeous. Probably only like a almost five pounder's mouth, but this fish is long and super healthy. Oh, thanks for biting, dude. Peace. Kachow. Dude, my man's went running. I thought I had an eight. The way he took off. Like legit, thought I had an eight. Oh my. Like he just took off. You know, like really big trophy bass take off and dig straight down at the same time. That's what he was doing. Oh man. Finally. Oh. Oh. No way he missed that. No way he missed that. Bro, what? <laughs> Bro, what? No shot, dude. Wow. I hope the camera got that. Let me angle this thing down a little bit more. He wasn't big, but it was one more fish. There he is. Come on. Right where he's supposed to be. Not a big one, but... Oh, yeah, finally. <laughs> oh, you've been caught a lot, cuz. There we go, guys. Fish number five. Give him a pound and a half. So it puts us, what, that would have been at 15. So it puts us, like, 16 and a half. Oh, yeah. 16 and a half of the top five so far. There he is. Come on, be bigger, be bigger. Come on, I don't think so. Knock that last one out though. Nope. And he came off. Why did my rod feel like that? He might have been just a little bit bigger than that. Last one we just got on. Dude, my rod felt so weird right there. All right, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. I want to thank you for all the support again recently, guys. We're still on the road to 25,000 subscribers. So if you're not already, please hit that subscribe button. Please hit that like button. Uh, honestly, I thought we could have been there by uh, this time, but things slowed down. This time of year really slows down for uh, us content creators, us YouTube creators. I'm really glad I found some uh, new spots today here in the area. It gets... It gets really old fishing the same spots every single time. You know, they are reliable, but you know, it is fun to try new spots and show you guys that we can really fish wherever, whenever, with whatever. And like I said in the beginning, go check out Pond Boys. All his stuff's gonna be linked down in the description. Maybe we can collab one day. He had to get out of here right when I saw him. He had to catch a flight. Super cool dude, really down to earth. Love that guy. We met at ICAST this last year. And with that said, guys, catch you on the next fishing adventure. Peace.